cannot give you back your homes or restore your dead to life, but perhaps I can give you justice in the name of our king. Hey everyone, today we are going to talk about quite possibly the most outrageous Game of Thrones theory that is out there. I'm referring to the mythical blue-eyed giant named McCumber. If that doesn't ring a bell, then check this out. One time she told me, the sky is blue because we live inside the eye of a blue-eyed giant named Macumba. Maybe we do. Are you interrogating me, Lord Tywin? Some believe the king choked. Some believe the sky is blue because we live inside the eye of a blue-eyed giant. I wanted to show the scenes referring to this giant because it is exclusive to the HBO series, meaning Macumba did not exist in the books. Here's the theory. Although characters in the show mention the blue-eyed giant in a very dismissive way, McCumber may in fact be real, and supposedly his eye contains the known world and all of its life. This is a great example of an ultimate end theory, because most every fan believes that Game of Thrones will reveal a huge surprise at the very end. To me it seems like an interesting children's story. You know, the kind of story that will address some of the common questions children may ask about the world. For example, why is the sky blue? Many children who hear the giant's eye story probably grow up for a while thinking that the sky is blue because of the color of McCumber's eye. Like Rob Stark or Oberyn Martell, these children will eventually grow up and realize the story was all fiction. Other people like Bran Stark may be more open-minded and believe there's no reason to ultimately discount the story. From a fan's perspective, knowing now that Old Nan was right about a lot of the Long Night history, I would be more inclined to take a further look into McCumber. Thinking about it, most stories originate from a singular point where events may or may not have happened, and over time the story changes, adapting to its audience. It's impossible to say now what's beyond the mapped out area that is the known world, and beyond that, it's even harder to say what the universe is like. Even though it's outrageous, I could see the show going in the direction of a big reveal at the very end with something like Bran waking up from a coma and dreaming up a lot of the events that took place throughout the seasons. You know what? Do me a favor and in your spare time, try to watch the very first episode again and think about the ending when Jamie pushes Bran off of the tower. After that, Bran could be in a coma, envisioning the chain of events that would lead to the entirety of his house falling. I'm not saying this is the truth, but I can definitely see the possibility of this outcome. It would be a shame if it was all a dream, but compared to the McCumber blue-eyed giant theory, I feel like it makes more sense. I've had many people suggest doing a video with my thoughts on the giant theory. I know it's a super short video, but I wanted to finally do a discussion on this. My belief is that the showrunners wanted to add this folklore with the intentions of keeping our minds open. Old Nan wasn't just an old woman shouting absurdities. There were hard facts embedded in her stories, even in the books. So it would make sense the showrunners would include a creation theory that constantly is dismissed within the realm. With a world that has more mythical creatures than I can count, I won't immediately drop the possibility of a blue-eyed giant ending. It sounds crazy, but I think it would be rather awesome if it were true. Let me know your thoughts. Have a great day, take care, and I will see you tomorrow.